my channel it's Anaya back with another video and today I have for you this rainbow winged liner inspired by pride month so first I went ahead and filled my eyebrows in and I set my eyelids with this Maybelline face powder and now I'm just going to start drawing the wing for that I'm going to use a NYX HD concealer in the color light to make everything easier I started out with a thinner wing and this is my bad eye so this wing is not as good as the other one will be but I like to start out with a thin wing and I just go all the way across my eye all the way to the inner corner now I'm just going to make the wing thicker so I just extend like the tail a little bit and then I just go in and make it thicker from there dragging it all the way across the eye making it thicker all the way across not just on the tail and I'm going to do the other eye this eye is much easier for me so as you can see this wing is going to be a lot faster and it's going to look better too For my colors today, I'm going to be using these NYX Ultra Pro Mania pigments. I found that the colors show up better if you don't set the concealer. Like if you set it with like a white eyeshadow for example, um, the colors don't show up as pigmented in my experience. So I didn't set it. And I'm just going to start out with the orange and then move on to the yellow. Next, I'm going to do the green. Next is blue. And the last color is purple. Now I'm just going to start kind of blending all of the colors together because I didn't want it to look like color blocked. I wanted there to be like a smooth transition between each color. So I'm just adding more pigment and blending the colors into each other more. Okay, so my camera went out of focus here, so these next couple clips of me filling in this line are going to be kind of fuzzy or blurry, but I'm doing the exact same thing I did on the other eye, but I'm just doing it like opposite. So instead of starting with orange, this time I'm going to start with purple and have the orange on the inner corner. And I'm going to do the same thing with blending and adding more pigment. Here I'm just going to clean up my wing. An easier way to do this would just be to like put tape around it so that you don't have to do this, but I didn't use tape so now I'm just taking some, I use brush cleaner and I just cleaned up the wing. So after this I went ahead and did my face routine off camera, I will link that in the cards above. So now I'm just going to be using this Milani blush in the color, I think this is Coral Cove. Now for the under eyes, I wanted the under eyes to be colorful too, so I'm going to take the Morphe 35B palette and I'm going to take the red color and I'm going to put that on my outer corner. Next I'm going to take orange and put that in the center of my lower lash line. Basically I'm taking the three colors on the outer edge of my wing. So next I'm going to take yellow and on top of that I'm going to put this shimmery yellow color. So I'm going to put that in the inner corner of my lower lash line and then I'm going to take the shimmery shade and put that on top. I didn't have a red pigment, which is why there's no red in the wing, but I did want to include red on my lower lash line. So here you can just see how it looks. And now for the other, I'm going to do the same thing. So I'm going to take purple, blue, and green. So I'm going to take this dark purple and put that on the outer corner here. Then I'm going to take the blue color, <laughs> the blue color, and put that in the center. Next is green, and then I'm going to take that shimmery green and put that on top. Mm -hmm. 
now just applying some mascara as normal I put a little bit on my top lashes which I normally don't do but according like since I used the pigments there was a lot of fallout on them so I just needed to make them black and now I'm going to apply some lashes these are the kiss um, poise lashes Also, please excuse my lash band. I was kind of not really in a rush, but I had already filmed this tutorial before. And so this is me refilming it for a second time because I had trouble the first time. And so I was really just like trying to hurry up. <laughs> so that's why my lash line doesn't look as clean as it could. And now I'm just going to use some Carmex. And since the eyes are so colorful, I kept the lip simple with some clear lip gloss. And that is the finished look. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe as well as to follow me on all my other social medias which are always down below and I will see you in my next video.